Well, today's video, this video is mostly about uh, iPhone boot loop. I don't know, mostly you guys who, who, who is having a problem with iPhone 10, especially because I had an iPhone 10 and it started when I wanted to update iPhone 10 to 15 point something. Before it was completely fine, there was no any problem, it was working awesome, all right? But when I tried to update it, it showed me the problem. Um, it was showing boot loop, and then afterwards, it was showing um, iPhone, Apple Store, Restore, something kind of um, uh, picture. It was coming up, there was nothing uh, happening. Uh, I went to uh, different shop, mobile shop. I went to my Mac, my Mac today, my Mac um, Apple uh, reseller, it says premium, premium reseller. And they say there was a problem with um, um, it was James who, who did it. And it's, it was saying verify issue reported by a customer, attempted to restore, you need multiple times, error code 4013, uh, return multiple times, suggesting hardware issue, whole unit replacement required. They, they, they're saying whole unit replacement required, uh, additional $899 for this service. Are you kidding me? All right, replacement iPhone will have warranty up to 24 months. SMS notification sent to customer to contact store. Anyway, and they charged me like they didn't even, they charged me $49 to just um, re restore, which I could do it and I did it and it didn't happen, okay? And they just charged me $49 and that's insane. $49 and you can see there. Well, and then I came home and thinking that why it's wrong because it was working completely fine okay it was it was it was completely fine so and then i came home i tried uh to do it my own way which is that way because anyway 899 iphone 11 is 840 and they were charging me 899 just to you know make it nice uh an old old fan so I came over home, I used this one up, and I'm using this app, which is um, this app, I, I phone, I my phone fix pro. So I came over, they were saying that there was a hardware problem, blah, 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 blah. And I opened it up, and you can see, um, well, give me a sec. Well, you can see that's the proximity. Someone said it's a proximity. I saw a YouTube video and someone told me that the face ID, especially the face ID, which is this one. If you take it out, this, this plug and disconnect it and try to reboot or, you know, use anything from iTunes, though, though I used iTunes and it didn't work. I disconnect this, which is the Face ID one. I disconnect this one and I tried from through iTunes. Uh, it didn't work. And then I used um, I my phone fixpo, and I did exit recovery mode, taking this this um, connector out. I disconnected this one and I tried that one. It opened it up. Said so, Zam. It, it worked, it, it worked man, and uh, you you cannot have a face ID, which is completely fine, I think, rather than paying $899. Uh, you can put your password, which is, you, you, you used to do it, and you can do it now as well. Um, but I'm trying to do um, another way, which is again, a DFE mode. Um, so, yeah, DFE mode. Um, so I'm trying last time uh, downloading. Um, so it worked perfectly, what I meant. And then I tried, now I'm trying with plugging up and it didn't work again. So I'm trying to do another way, which is on iMyPhone fix for this. It's, it's downloading this, this firmware. 
I'm trying to download this one and try to use. I think they're gonna charge me some $29 or something to do this one. Uh, but you know, I wanna try this one if it works. If it doesn't work, um, then I'm gonna just disconnect that that face ID protector or something like that. Uh, and I'm gonna use it like that because it was perfectly fine. It was working amazingly. I mean, the phone, uh, camera, and everything was working, uh, sound, everything. So I don't know why, why this, these guys saying my Mac and everyone I think, I don't know. It's saying um, whole unit replacement required. Additional $899 for this size. So that's, it's insane for me because I can't pay because no one can, and it was working perfectly fine. But when I started, because they have, this is completely Apple uh, mistake. I don't know why why you would say update and then you 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 freak up something on your phone i think it's a scam i don't know what it is i think i don't know uh, so that you can buy a new so phone phone is working perfectly now as you can see but i can't do my face id and i can show you like this see it comes straight away to my password so but rather than that i think it works perfectly there's no any problem with it so uh, yeah, that's what it is. But let me try this way. So I don't know if something goes wrong with your phone as well. Um, if it says boot loop and everything stuff in, and they try to get you know, uh, so yeah, it's a ninety-nine dollar for. Cause this phone is absolutely fine. I don't know why they see wrong with it. So yeah, guys, if you have a problem with same thing, then just open it up um you can disconnect and use it uh as without a, without any face id you can use your phone um someone and the guy who who helped me up on youtube his account i don't know he uh he tried to uh, take it out the prospector that, that that special thing for face id he tried he bought a new one and put it through but it didn't work so you know i'm trying my best over here as well uh but guys if you have a problem with the same i think that's 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 a simple solution for you and save you a lot of money. I mean, eight hundred ninety nine dollar is 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 a huge 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 thing. Cool man. Um, I will just sign it up. So yeah, thanks thanks for watching this video and I and I think it it helped you out. Cool. Have a nice day, mate. Thank you.